بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم ان دا نیم آف اللہ دا موسٹ بینیفیشنٹ ان دا موسٹ مرسفہ السلام علیکم مائی لیولی سٹوڈنٹس ان مائی انجلز ہاو آر یو ڈوئنگ ان ہاو آر یو ڈے آئی ہوپ یو آر انجوئنگ دا چینجنگ ویدر بیکوز اٹس آلسو اکمپنیڈ بی دا رین اینڈ یو وڈ بی انجوئنگ آئی یوزولی انجوئی دا کولڈ بیکوز وی کین سیٹ ان سن اینڈ وی انجوئی دا سن I hope you will also enjoy. And as the rain. My lovely students, I'm your teacher, Mrs. Kesh. For the 42nd recorded lesson, here we are going to revise, but with a slight modification, we are going to revise vegetable names. Normally in our paper, we you are given such such picture and you are asked to write the name beneath like it's tomato you are supposed to write the name beneath and here it is potato you are supposed to write the name beneath here it is p and peas so you would write the name beneath and carrot write the name beneath but now is we are not able to take your paper physically face to face we cannot evaluate you so now virtually we did a slight modification to our exam but always we make you ready enough for exam that you just need to revise it slightly you don't really need to revise it a lot isn't it yes so you better need to learn it the classic way as well. Like if it is tomato, you need to know when you see the picture of tomato, you need to learn. And you need, would need to be able to write the name, okay? Because uh, uh, tomorrow or day after tomorrow, this situation is going to change. You are going, inshallah, you will soon come back to school. So you should be well prepared for the next classes. Don't take your lesson slightly cover everything now here it is tomato what will you write you will write tomato t-o-m-a-t-o tomato t-o-m-a-t-o tomato well done t-o-m-a-t-o tomato so this is tomato t-o-m-a-t-o tomato now you need to write it down okay I learned the spelling well now look here potato can you tell me how to write potato the first sound is p, p then o then t t a t p t and then t o t o t o it is very really easy okay p o t a t o potato p o t a t o potato so potato tomato potato now peas and carrot p e a s peas and C A W R O T carrot. Now learn this spelling well. So you would be able to write it yourself. In come on, revise with me. T O M A T O tomato T O M A T O tomato Well done P O T O M A T O tomato P then P O T A T O tomato then peas, P-E-A-S, peas. P 
peace. P E A S, peas. And carrot, C A R R O T, carrot. Now, in exam, you we are going to give you like this. You better take the practice sheets, okay? We had designed for you the practice sheet in that everything is included. You better take that and learn all. This way, you now there is a month or two, uh, you will uh, be promoted to the next classes. If you are able to do all your sheets yourself, then this is the sign that you are ready for the next class, okay? So you can revise everything in that and learn. Now look here. This is the picture of what? Yes, carrot. And what is written down? Potato. So is it potato? No, it is not a potato. The statement is given that is it true or false? You will choose that is it a potato? No, it's not a potato. So we are going to say false. Now look here. It is a picture of potato. And beneath it's written P O T A T O potato. Potato. The picture of potato and also the word both are right, they go with each other. So we would say true or false. Yes, it is true. Now look at it. Here is a picture of carrot and beneath C A R R O T carrot. Carrot. Now is it true or false? It's true. Now look here, potato, C A D B R O T, carrot, but the picture is potato. Now this is false because it is not carrot, it is potato. This is not potato, it is carrot, but here it's written potato, so we say false. It's not right. Here it is potato, and the picture is potato as well, so we said right, true. Here it's carrot and the word is also carrot, so we say true. Potato. P O T A T O. Potato. Now look here. Tomato. T O M A T O. Tomato. Now is it true or false? It is true because this is the picture of tomato and the word tomato is written down as well. Now look here. The picture of tomato and it is written carrot. Carrot, C A D L R O T, carrot. So you are going to decide whether it's true or false, and it is definitely false. Why? Because it is not a carrot; it is a tomato, and beneath we can read it's a carrot written. Now look here, peas, P E A S E, peas. It is a picture of peas. Yes, it's right. Now you are going to decide true or false. Yes, it is true. Now, tomato, T-O-M-A-T-O, -T -O, tomato, but the picture is for peas. So, you are going to decide whether it's true or false. It is false. Let's revise it once. Again, the picture is carrot, but we need it's written potato, so it's false. The picture is for potato and potato is written beneath. So it is true. Here we have a carrot. While the carrot is written as well. So we would say true. Here we have carrot. Word carrot but the picture for potato. So we would say false. And here tomato. And the picture is well, tomato, the word tomato is, so we would say true. No, it is tomato, but the carrot is written beneath, so we would say false. Peas, so we would say true. And tomato, so we would say false. So my lovely students, that was it for the day. Now let's revise it as well. It is a it 
Okay, is it a cup? Yes, is it a, is it a bag? No, is it a car? No, is it a handkerchief? Yes, is it a flower? No, is it a car? Yes, is it an airplane? Yes, is it an umbrella? No, is it a tree? No, is it a flower? Yes, is it a clock? No, is it a door? Yes, so now you must need to revise and read yourself even in the now you we practice everything a lot you should yourself even read uh, all the statements yourself in the paper okay that was it for the day see you in the next lesson on sunday till then goodbye